Hey everyone, welcome to Shop Talk. We're looking at Hal's 550 Home Light Chainsaw, and I get questioned quite a bit on how to test the ignitions on these 550s. The 550, the 360, 350, 450, 750, 650. All those home lights use the same ignition system, and I'll show you a quick and easy way to test them. Originally, home light came out with this little cover here, it was clear, semi clear. It's got a little bulb in here and a diode and you take a spark plug out and you would put this on here and spin it over and you see just a very faint glow there there's very low voltage there easier way to test it let's get you a test light I've got it hooked up to the ground over here touch it to the terminal on the right side and spin the solver real fast and you'll see a little pulsating here watch right in this area here Good way to test it. Uh, the way the old technicians used to test it was to take the spark plug out, wet your two fingers here, put them right on those two little prongs, and you will feel about the same uh, tickle as you would with a little transistor battery. Barely feel anything when you spin it over real fast. You just barely. But that's a quick, easy way to test those modules. Very rare that the, tr that the transformer goes bad. I worked on thousands of these old home lights when they were popular back in the 70s and early 80s. These just don't go bad unless something comes apart in the spring here or a tab breaks. Super rare. What usually goes bad is the module. And the modules are easily replaced. You can pick them up if you got a big 750 you're wanting to restore. Look around for a 360 chainsaw. Pick up that module, put it in there, and you'll be going. If this one has good fire, and uh, if you've got any questions on that, give the chainsaw guy a call.